Um, about this woman who who got a kite and she really likes it. So it's sort of all about like the adventures that she had with the kite and then coming back to her grandma. I like it when she was like uh, when the when she first saw the kite flying around in her room and she tries catching it and she got all happy. I liked it when uh, the people were interpreted as puppets because they thought it was really creative. I liked the scene where they were in the kitchen and the grandmother kept putting the tray out and it was like through time and then progressively it got better the relationship but you could really see the struggle between them and I, I felt really moved by that. Mine was the scene between the two people in the trench coats and the girl when they were playing with her and the blanket. It was lovely, it was very smooth movement. My favourite part is the part of the train when the grandmother and the girl are sitting on the train and I just love the way that it was portrayed. How the people made it look like they were the wind was the best part for what was the best part of the, of the entire performance. It was quite it was playful, but at the same time it was so emotionally heavy. It was sad as well. The scene with the grandmother and, then, yeah. and the picture. It was just up and down in so many smooth, brilliant ways. It was ways. a great experience. It was really like a journey through. Yeah. But I'm sure it's fun for the children as well with the kite. The, the children in the front were really excited by that as well. Yeah, so yeah the kids loved it at the front. You could see them reaching out for the kite and everything. The puppetry really made them giggle and laugh. Yeah. Old people would just maybe it would touch them in a way with the mother and the grandmother and generations. Um, funny, silly, cool, sad at some times, but also uh, like relieved and happy at other times. Mm -hmm. Happy, funny, and colourful. Moving, exciting, and inspirational. Yeah, happy and, and special. special. All right. I would absolutely give it five stars. I don't think I've fallen in love with a piece of theatre quicker than that.